All right, let's keep going. One more, here we go. Uh, we do have too few champions, so let's start recruiting some people. Just to have a little bit more in the troop department. We are still low, but that's fine. We don't care about that, and we do need to watch out for our vassals losing when they die. We can go out right against you now. And since we're already going to be getting our manpower going, we're going to declare war against the young king here and take Linecaster. Um, we will call our family and our allies in for this war just because we might as well. And I believe this might be the final um, thing we need. So let's also hire you. And let's see, what allies do we have? Uh, this one is the one we're going to need help with. Definitely more than anything and we'll call you in for that war as well cool excellent so we're going to get them all in this and then so we're going to take this army and go straight down there and then the rest of you are going to go take out ormond real quick for me just because it'll be an easy victory all right let's take this out and then we'll go land in france to be fair, I really don't need to worry about them taking the land as much. So we're going to finish this war off real quick. Let's go over here. Yeah, do that. That's fine. Okay, let's finish that war off so we don't have to worry about it. And now, now we need to plan to go invade France. So this is going to cost me a lot of money right here. So... Here goes something. We're also going to grant this because this belongs to Munster. So I'm going to grant this land to you. Enjoy. There you go. All right. Now it's time to attack outright into France. Let's kill some Frenchmen. All right. Plan cultivation to develop the, the county control better. Um, yeah, I'll accept that for now. Let's take this back. That's 88, and now we need... Are they attacking us anywhere? No, it looks like we're fine. So, I mean, we could be real dicks and go siege the capital. Um, I think that we're going to split this, though. Yeah, and this army's going to go there instead. Oh, well, that's already 90%. So let's see if we get it. And there is Blood Eagle, the achievement. All right. Well, we've done what we came here to do in this last episode. So we're going to finish up the episode, um, naturally, um, as we always do, because we got to at least create the Kingdom of Ireland. So let's get our men back, and we're going to go ahead and disband and then do one last thing. But, yeah, we got Blood Eagle finally. So I'll be uploading this here shortly. Uh, this is going to be a fun one to upload. I'm looking forward to it. Holy shit. Well, we just made a lot of gold right there. Uh, you can marry. Go ahead and marry. And then... Sure, you can also marry there. So... There we go. And there's some more cash. Uh, let's usurp that title. To grant to... You know what? Why not? You can have it. Alright, there's that. And now we just need to create the title, the Kingdom of Ireland. And we are good, which in my opinion is my main goal now. At least to finish out the episode. I think that's always fair. Is to, if I had known it would finish so quickly, I would have, uh, you know, t milked it a little bit more. <laughs> but that's how we do. So, yeah, we've managed to do it. I'm uh, kind of shocked, to be honest. Let's work off some stress. There we go, so now we're off that. Um, we'll scour for the murderer, apparently, that's going on. And we have a lot of cash now, so... Or not a lot of cash, but a lot of manpower now. So we've pretty much set ourselves up to never have to do anything. We can just pretty much chill now that we hold the, king, the empire. We'll take a concubine, sure. We're actually making less gold than I was expecting at this point, but... 
Um, still not too terrible, in my opinion. Uh, yeah, get out of my bed. Did you just give me lover's pox? No, we're divorcing you. I don't care. She's got lover's pox, so we're going to marry someone else. Yep, there you go. Because, nope, not happening. Let's get that plus 12 and enjoy it. Yeah, and look, we've even eliminated just about all of their culture. Make sure that book gets to you. That's fine. We're going to cheer on our champions. We've done well this session. I mean, I'm pretty proud. It only took us about 10, 1,018 years. So, not too terrible um, to get the achievement. Yep, we're going to marry you off just to get you out of the family tree or family area. Um... Let me know what you guys are thinking for your the next one we should do. I uh, I've been thinking about doing dog give a dog a bone. Haven't decided though yet. Um, kind of working on it. We have gained a new advancement. Nice. So we've got that now. Uh, let's get battlements focused, and we can now go in here to succession and change it to partition. So that is always now going to be better. Did my heir die? Yeah, he did. So his heir is going to take over. And he is terrible. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, well, we'll create the Kingdom of Ireland. And we'll call that the final portion of the episode. That's kind of what we're aiming for right now. Just saving up a little bit more gold. And then we're going to give that title out. There we go. We now, in my opinion, have the full setup. Kingdom of Ireland created at last. And we can transfer the vassals under him. That's fine. So we have created our kingdom. Uh, and the last thing I am going to do is just because I can, I'm going to grant you the title of the Kingdom of England. And now, now it's all under one individual. So that way we are... A united front who's at civil war in Scotland. Thank you all for watching the series. I hope you've enjoyed. And I will see you on the next series. What could it be? Thank you.